under Nanny and found this advert. Animal McMagic. <laughs> Nannies for all. It's like Nanny McPhee. What's going on, geeks? Welcome if you're new. Welcome back if you're returning. I am Leland, that is Mark, and we are Geek Union. And today is a geek's choice, my choice, and it is Grizzlies. <laughs> <laughs> Why the fuck did I think of oh, cooties? <laughs> Tales of the Grizzly Gruesome Kids. <laughs> Grizzly. Grizzly Tales for Gruesome Kids. <laughs> Gruesome Tales for Grizzly Kids. <laughs> um, Last time we did Even Stevens, and that shit was cringe. Yes, uh, it's Disney. It's original Disney. Now it's your choice, but obviously today we're doing my own. Yeah, I have no idea what the fuck Gruesome Kids for Grizzly Tales is fucking... <laughs> <laughs> like, what the fuck that is. It is technically... Like, Tales it, for, like, fucking... It is technically supposed to be two episodes, but... Because, obviously, you'll have a longish. Oh. But it's fine, we're doing the first tale. Just like ten, yeah, that's why it's like, yeah, that's why it's like ten. I remember watching this late five o'clock in the afternoon or the evening or whatever after school on CITV. Okay. Single-handedly the best kids channel for freeview shit. <laughs> uh, CI, uh, CBBC had some good stuff like back in the day now, until like two thousand and ten, two thousand and eleven maybe. I'd say two thousand and ten. And then it started going downhill. Yeah, that was because you're getting older. But with that being said, it's time to do the reaction slash comment here. Yes. Let's get going. Like and subscribe. Grizzly tales of gruesome kids. Yeah. It's cringe. It's already given me like a nightmare, uh, not nightmare on the street, but uh, nightmare before Christmas like vibe. And that's a movie I've actually never fucking seen. You are welcome to Grizzly Tales for Gruesome Kids. I call this tale the new nanny. All children are little liars. And any child who says he isn't is the biggest liar of them all. And uh, that dude is the stuff in nightmares as well. There is a family living in South London that has the collective intelligence of a dead ant. Hi, Dennis. Spend their days being completely unpleasant, Mrs. Mack. Fucking evil kids. Oh no, they just bye. killed. They just killed the nanny. <laughs> they put the bits they don't want onto her chair. How the fuck does she not know that that was on her chair? I know. They pretend to be asleep. It's fine. Just stick a, a toast or something in the wall. How was your day? Mrs. Mack. Beat us good. today. Oh, really? She <laughs> beat us with your golf clubs, Daddy. So where's the marks? Yeah. Under Nanny and found this advert. Animal McMagic. <laughs> Nannies for all. It's like Nanny McPhee. They are the most adorable little children. There'll be somebody round in half an hour. Fuck me, man. That was quick. I'm your new Nanny. <laughs> Nanny, I'm you nanny. Treat me just as you would any other nanny. Which was the worst thing the snake stuck her tail in hot water. Why the fuck would she do that? How was the new nanny? She tried to strangle me when she gave me a hug. What the fuck is all that? <laughs> 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 Find me another day. Your new nanny will be dropping in shortly. I'm your new nanny. We always have a bath after breakfast. It's a well known fact that spiders hate water. So when the children push their new nanny into the bath and what the fuck is it whacking the plug, she was a terrified. A rage. Bye bye, you creepy fucking shit. <laughs> What a fun game. What's it called? Poke the nanny. She's even more cruel than the snake. Tristram. Yeah, I don't know why people do that. I wasn't lying. My fingers were crossed. <laughs> As it happens, we have the perfect nanny right here. The perfect This is Trunchbull. I'm your Nanny. 
So it's just gonna eat the kids. It's a croc, what do you expect? They couldn't find the children. They did, however, find two eggs in the airing cupboard, which they took downstairs and boiled for their tea. I was wondering if you'd found a new nanny yet. No. In that case, would you like me? Hello, dear. <coughs> Help is on the way, dear. Imagine if she was a witch. And Mr. Frightfully Busy bent down to pick up Mrs. Mac's suitcases. He noticed that one was made of snake skin. You believe me, don't you? Because yes. every word of See, it's the stuff of nightmares. Not one word of a lie. Woo, woo. La Pants la. On fire. Pants on fire. See you later, alligator. <laughs> Let's watch it again. Don't watch it again. <laughs> <laughs> that show has made me want to continue fucking smoking again. <laughs> Full time. <laughs> what do you want about? It's the best show ever. It's fucking, it was boring. <laughs> it, it's not boring. Don't fucking diss the Grizzly Tales for Gruesome Kids. It was, it was boring. <laughs> Don't diss the Gruesome Tales for Grizzly Kids. But that was my commentary and your reaction to grizzly tales of Christmas kids yes well i'll say this it was extremely fucking british of course it is it's a british show well it, well there's british and there's extremely fucking british it's like dick van dyke and fucking mary poppins where his cockney accent is just just over the fucking top but growing up with uh like mary poppins and shit you appreciate it. <laughs> but if you were to watch it now... <laughs> you'd still appreciate it. Well, you'd... Because Mary Poppins is is, is a classic. Yes, but you just wouldn't appreciate Dick Van Dyke's fucking version of a Cockney accent. <laughs> yeah, but are you sure it's even Cockney? Yeah. But that was Tales of the Grizzly Kids. For yes. the gruesome kids. Yes. Not the stupid looking kids that you just want to punch in the fucking face. Dennis the Manus. What do you think of it? <laughs> watching it now like not having all the like memories in the past watching it so nostalgia yeah it was it was boring <laughs> <laughs> uh, but no if I was to watch this as a kid then <laughs> you <Your> shit bricks <laughs> well not really it's just the, the narrator the person just like yeah, he uses the stuff of fucking like that. Just look at his face. Mrs. But would I watch this now? Watch it, like, if I was to watch it as a kid? No. It'd just be one of those shows that I just leave in my past and never want to watch again. <laughs> That's not me hating on this fucking show. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. You but said it was boring. It is. <laughs> but you're hating on the show. The greatest no, show no. to ever exist. Definitely not. It fucking is. Definitely not. Like and subscribe, hit the notification bell so you never miss And tell your kids about us. <laughs> yes. Um, thanks for stopping by and remember, the world's always better when Geeks Unite. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.